So we're here at the second ghost ride in two days for a cyclist who, who was hit and, and killed. And in this case, it's a particularly um, heart-wrenching story because the cyclist was hit first by a car and then the people in the car attacked him and um, killed him. And so we're here to ride to the site where he died and remember his life and advocate for change because we, I'm here with my kids and um, I'm hoping that the city will change the way we do things and make it safe for cyclists so that uh, we can build a city that's better for everybody and better for the planet even. Today we're taking part in a ghost ride for Aaron Rankin Wright, a 19-year-old who was killed while riding his bicycle. already a memorial. We had a whole wrestling thing here yesterday after the funeral. Yeah. He was a wrestler? He was a wrestler, football player, rugby player. Just a wonderful human being. We are gathered here today to remember a fellow cyclist, Aaron Rankin Wright. 19 years old, was cycling on his way to work, was intentionally run down by a driver. We have a right to be on the road. We have a right to be safe on the road. Please remove your helmets or other headdress. We're gonna hold a moment of silence for Aaron. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, I believe we have a song. We have come too far. We can turn around. We'll flood the streets with justice. We are freedom bound. We have come too far. We can we have turn around. Come too far. We'll flood the This is the part of the ceremony. If anyone from the family or Aaron's friends want to speak to the crowd, this is the time. If they do not, that's fine. In that case, our ceremony is over. Thank you very much for coming, everyone. Please remember Aaron. Be safe out there. We have come too far, we can't turn around. We'll flood the streets with justice, we are freedom bound.